This is Charles A. Young. He was the third African-American to graduate from West Point. Born on March 12, 1864, Young arrived at West Point in June of 1884 to formally begin the four-year course. He graduated from the Military Academy on August 31, 1889. Given where he's placed in this photograph, his status as a cadet was obviously nothing the Academy wanted to highlight. Considering the state of race relations at the time, his stay at the Academy could not have been the most pleasant. However, he graduated from the Military Academy on August 31st, 1889, commissioned as a second lieutenant. After graduation, he was appointed to the 10th U.S. Cavalry Regiment, but the War Department decided to transfer him to the 25th U.S. Colored Infantry Regiment. Eventually rising to the rank of Colonel, Young became military professor at Wilberforce University, and among his many accomplishments was service in the Philippines, Blanca Aurora, Duraga, Tobaca, Rosanna and San Joaquin. He served as military attaché to the United States legation Port-au-Prince, Haiti, and military attaché to the American legation in Monrovia, Liberia. Colonel Young was elected as the second honorary member of the Omega Phi Psi fraternity, and he wrote a book entitled Military Morale of Nations and Races. As a well-deserved tribute to his outstanding military service in Liberia, he received the NAACP Spingarn Medal. Colonel Young died on January 8, 1922, and was given a military funeral in Lagos, Nigeria. He was buried in an English cemetery. However, in June of 1923, Colonel Young was brought home, and West Point's third black graduate was given a hero's burial at Arlington National Cemetery. <laughs> Obituaries often serve as information about individuals about which we rarely, if at all, hear. Such is the case with this Army General. He is Roscoe Robinson, Jr. The General was born in St. Louis, Missouri in 1921. He graduated from the U.S. Military Academy in 1951 and received a master's degree in international relations at the University of Pittsburgh. General Robinson also completed the Army's command at General Staff College, as well as the National War College. During the Vietnam War, the General was Deputy Chief of Staff for Logistics. General Robinson served as Plans Officer and Southeast Asia Special Actions Officer, U.S. Pacific Command. He was Brigade Commander with the 82nd Airborne Division as Deputy Commander and then Commander of the Army Garrison on Okinawa. He has also served as personnel officer at the Pentagon. Among his many military decorations are the Distinguished Flying Cross, Distinguished Service Medal, the Silver Star with Oak Leaf Clusters, the Bronze Star, and Master Parachutist Badge. His last assignment was as United States Representative to the North Atlantic Treaty Organization, Military Committee, International Military Activity. General Robinson had served 34 years in the Army at his retirement and has served in segregated units when first commissioned as an officer. General Robinson was married and the father of two children, a daughter, Carol Robinson Royal, and a son, Captain Bruce E. Robinson, stationed at the Pentagon. The general rests among the honored at Arlington National Cemetery. <laughs>